Today in this video, I'm not gonna be just replacing the grip tape on my Varla Eagle 1. I'm also gonna be opening up the deck, checking the controllers and the battery area for potential water damage because I was caught in bad rain lately in my area. It was completely unavoidable and I had to get home. Now the IP rating on this electric scooter is IP54 which is pretty much the standard for most electric scooters out there, but it does no harm in checking for potential damage underneath, and you can even put some silicone layer to avoid potential issues from actually happening. Nothing is guaranteed, but when you do go to check, it's always a good idea to check actually where the gasket is going around the electric scooter, checking for water ingress and water staining. You can see actually, I'm checking where the controllers are, all the cables because if there is water you will see staining right below on the deck space make sure you do use a good led light so you can really get a good look in there it's you know it's it only takes a few minutes to really do something like this and i would highly recommend doing it from time to time because water can seep in basically anywhere if it's not sealed correctly in this occasion after closely inspecting even in between the battery compartment there everything seems pretty solid sometimes there is also a it's kind of like a tape that changes to a pinkish color when water gets in on the batteries but on this case it's not there it's something to definitely look out for if you have a different electric scooter if you want to avoid water damage it's always a good idea to even put silicone around where the gasket is itself and put the deck on afterwards to make sure you have a good water tight seal it's always a good idea to make sure to even take pictures because if you end up taking your internals apart you can get confused on which way it goes back so make sure to take pictures as you go along and as you are screwing go in a zigzag motion i would highly recommend just use just tightening them with your hand first then using a drill to put them home obviously clean the deck afterwards make sure it's nice and clean and put the grip tape down as best as you can also after this video i did end up putting gorilla tape just at the front of the stem there because uh, water can actually seep through there and the silicone did break away a little bit it's always a good idea i've had made multiple videos on water damage to avoid on the viral eagle one feel free to check out that full playlist and here's just a top tip here the back on this can be very slippy add some grip tape there and you're good to go